Hey guys, it's Sunny. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. This is going to be a Christmassy rant, okay? A Christmassy rant. Okay, so somebody yesterday at work, they went, they go, oh, I don't really get presents anymore. Christmas is kind of for kids, or Christmas is for kids. Christmas is for the young. And I'm like, girl, you're not even 25, you're not even 26. You're still young, so why aren't you getting any gifts? If you have children, babies in your life, they go to school. They can get you presents, they can make you macaroni art. But the one thing I will not do is miss out on Christmas because I am too old and have kids like are you kidding me y'all little fingers can work on some macaroni art some little sculptures and the earth provided clay for a reason and play-doh so go get you some play-doh make me a figurine for christmas because i'm not going to be skimped out on because i'm too old i'm not even 30 yet i'm not even my mid-20s yet i want presents just like you do and i deserve them just like you children's do and everybody needs a Christmas. If I get you a gift, I expect a gift in return, people. Well, actually, that's not really the spirit of Christmas. The spirit is of giving and happiness and love and... <laughs> but the one thing that kind of gets me is that when you get older, a holiday is supposed to switch ownership, kind of. Like, when you're, when you're old... You can't celebrate the holiday anymore. You can't expect gifts anymore. You can't expect to receive anything anymore. And I'm going to kind of go branch off and go into Halloween. What? Ooh, story time. Story time. Okay. <clears throat> so one year on Halloween, I have always been a bigger person, a bigger kid. So one year on Halloween, I dressed up as something crazy and I went trick-or-treating. So, we kind of like lived in a, a, a really wealthy neighborhood then, kind of. Well, we lived close to a wealthy neighborhood, and my ass went trick-or-treating there. So I went to apparently the wrong house. I went to this woman's house, and this lady was like, <clears throat> Don't come back to my, my house next year. You are too old to be doing this. And I was like, I took, she gave, they were given like the full-size candy bars, and I was like, girl, guess who will be back next year? And was I back next year? Yes, I was back next year at her house, looking at her sitting in her chair in the front yard like, where's my full-size candy bar, ma'am? I'm back. You remember this fat face? You remember this fat face because I'm going to be back every year because you said that. But then I moved to L.A. so I couldn't go back and shove it in her face. But now I'm like in my 20s and I'm just like, I really can't kind of go back because I'm like six foot three, four and two million pounds and Halloween really kind of is over for me unless I go knocking on doors and people are like oh he's so big let's give him candy before he comes in and eats us alive because he's so big but back to Christmas okay so yes this Christmas time all Christmas times is about giving so if you got young children in your family make sure those young children are in their little kindergarten making you some little finger art making you some um some um some macaroni art for your wall or for your 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 desk at your job whatever because kids early need to know the spirit of giving gifts makes them a better adult y'all know what i'm saying y'all know what i'm saying you know so make sure those children know how to give gifts because they will be receiving them because they're probably small and cute and make sure your family is giving you gifts too no matter how old you are because when i'm 80 years old if someone's not coming to me and giving me a gift there it will be a problem and by that time i probably will might have dentures i will use those dentures on you okay so get me gifts even when i'm 80. Get your 80-year-old family's gifts. Get your, your, your adults who have kids' gifts. Kids, step it up. Make your macaroni art. To find you some clay or Play-Doh. Make your little figurine and give it as a gift. Because even if you make it, it means something. And do not play on this good holiday. Ooh, 
That could be an outro. Ooh, yep. Ooh, 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 ooh. Do not play on this good holiday. Thank you guys for watching my little rant. This is something different from my channel that I think I might do a little bit more. Like, we'll see. Um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Bye.